and welcome back to another crypto video. Yes, welcome back everybody. I hope you're doing fantastic. I just had a couple days away really. Um, I hope you also watched my new video on chart patterns. That'll be really, really helpful for you to understand some of the basic charts to help transform your crypto journey. So you can see that video um, on my channel. You're gonna see it under the tutorial section. So Big news for Cadena. We got some huge announcements. Um, Cadena is going to actually list as a, you know, a Cadena Bitcoin and BUSD um, trading pair. We've also got the USDT trading pair, and it's literally going to release in a few hours as I'm making this video. So we know that Cadena is one of our layer one infrastructure projects. It's a proof of work token. So it's actually got massive potential for the future. Think of things like Cardano, you know, back in the day or Harmony One or Phantom before they really exploded. So really, really interesting to see this. So announcement is massive. This is some huge news for Cadena. The fact that they are getting on Binance and we spoke about this not long ago saying how many infrastructure projects still do not have a listing on Binance and it's very important that they do. So Cadena also another bit of exciting teasing news, I suppose, as builders of Web3, we have this large opportunity in this moment to build. So it also kind of touches on Web3 and perhaps I've got something happening around there as well. Also in the future with Metaverse and other kind of projects there. So yeah, let's take a little look, look at our heat map of the day. You can see we're kind of flashing green. Infrastructure projects looking good. Currency, you know, we're a bit wavy. Um, Bitcoin is holding at $39,000 right now, so it's still pretty good. And yeah, everything else is looking kind of good as well. But more importantly, these blockchain infrastructures are looking really good. And their Cadena is up 20% on the day. So you already know what's happened, guys. We can already sort of tell what's happened, can't we? Well, I just want to say as well, massive thanks to my five patrons just here. You guys are awesome. If you want to become a patron, literally it's the price of a coffee. You're going to get one-on-one -on -one messaging. You're going to get a free ebook right here. You're going to get Discord access at premium level and access to giveaways. So make sure you don't miss out on those benefits. So Cadena trading at $7.00. 48 1.2 billion dollar market cap of 108 million trading volume so just under 10 percent there we're ranked 82 at the moment and a few days ago we were over rank 100 so we're sailing through you know the the ladder we're just overtaking everything one by one and if we click on that one year we can see we have still had this big correction from our previous all-time high of 24 dollars this looks like our undervaluation reaccumulation zone and i think it's quite important to to really look at this and, and be like well you know what can we do how can we identify this undervaluation zone well we can use our fib extension we're back down to the point 786 and then we can also use our fib extension here and then we can give ourselves a pragmatic target of 42 dollars and these usually do happen in the long run if this is a, a bear phase and it's long term and it's continued this is the sort of prices we can look at so 42 dollars is still realistic for me and you can see look at this this is obviously anomalous this volume is anomalous and it's obviously catalyzed through the news announcement so just be aware of of that um sorry i thought my webcam was off so just be aware of that because what's happened is now we've got this huge impulse a lot of buying pressure on the RSI. Of course, we've not even released yet, so we don't know what's going to happen. We could either get an influx or people could actually start selling, you know, buy the news, sell the hype sort of thing. And that's sort of what's happening. So you can see we're still in this channel here, guys. We're still in this consolidative channel where we're getting the impulse to retracement, impulse retracement. We're getting bumped at this resistance. The next level of resistance will be $10.03. So if we can come back through the $7 level, um, so the $7.60 level, that's where we're going to see potentially another big impulse to the upside. If we use our where did you go price label so if we can come back up to around seven dollars and ninety break through the resistance once again that we've just written in then we should be able to see continuation to around that ten dollar level there you can see very very euphoric stuff macd is ticking bullish we've got that big bullish crossover relative strength index we're seeing about 70 so we're not too overbought but on the hour time frame i reckon we're above so yeah there we go we are at 78 and you can see lots of selling pressure 
indicated by these big long wicks. So if we can get back through this trend line, then I'm going to start feeling macro bullish. But right now, I think everyone is piling in just because of the announcement. And usually that does lead to slight retracement. So if we were just to use our FIB extension, you know, you can expect that maybe we're going to come down a little bit lower. Um, where is my horizontal line here? Uh, yeah, I'll take this one. So you can expect that maybe we're going to come back to the 0.618 here something like that and the other levels we could drop down to 0.786 and the 0.5 so around there and around there yeah so these are the levels i think we could pull back to particularly these particular levels here so we've got six dollars seventy six sixty four six dollars thirty we could potentially pull back if we cannot keep the momentum going but let's wait and see what's going to happen long term super hyper bullish over the next decade for this project we're looking at 42 dollars in the next bull cycle and of course this news is just helping with the global exposure and the traction for Cadena. so if you like this project let me know in the comments leave some feedback down below what else you'd like me to look at also guys been experimenting with a bit of my fun portfolio um this crypto titans group here they basically give you trading signals on long and short positions um actually really kind of interesting because of course it's a trading bot and i usually go by my own human instincts but their algorithms seem to do quite cool so check that out as well in the link below make sure you subscribe to this channel too consider becoming a patron and hop into the discord whilst it's still open Kadena, good video good project very exciting times ahead let's see where we potentially bounce take easy guys